Hello you guys around this audience welcome to the random channel today we're going to be playing Evil Lands uh, if you can see the screen <laughs> holy fucking shit it looks pretty as fuck and that's not that's not just the front screen the game is actually really pretty um i don't know if you can hear the music the music also sounds really good uh let's play it i have already played it quite a bit this is my character uh my character is more of a glass cannon to be honest with you Go to the Shadow Islands. So this PvP and co-op mode. PvP is like they have their own um, like little uh, you know area, and we have our own area. We spawn, they spawn, and we go attack each other. I think it's like for honor, whatever. It was not in thir first person, as you can see. That look at that. Looks like pretty as fuck. Why the hell are frames dropping? Okay, I thought that because I was recording, the frames were dropping, but no. I'm playing at the maximum thing, I believe. Anyway, so this is the game. Here's the merchant. You can go get some quests from him. And here's another guy who gives quests. This guy also gives quests. Everyone pretty much gives quests. You can come here for daily quest and do some daily quest. I don't remember. What is this? Oh, right, right, right. This is like a flame aura thing, basically. If I activate this, everyone in my vicinity takes damage. We got this one basically freezes the enemy in front of us also slows them down we obviously have a fireball obviously you gotta have a fireball we also had a teleportation spell but i removed that uh let me see if i can re-equip that this one basically once this activates also, also you can see on the map the green dots they are players a uh, small white dots will be enemies and bigger white dots will be other enemies and you're trying to look for if you press this it teleports me way forward as you can see there's monsters over there um, I'm going to re-equip my flame aura let's kill some monsters and I'm gonna show you the combat how it works we got some werewolves first simple stuff back out fireball these fuckers done as you can see they are not strong enough to stand up to me uh, but then they come in hordes, it gets fucked up, really fucked up, real fucking fast. Uh, got some quests going at the moment. So the way I am supposed to, like, my quest is to find fire golems and find some iron ore. The way you find it is you just walk along the pathway. Uh, until this is a main mission, they don't really tell you where to go. Um, otherwise, you have to just walk around. And uh, whatever your objective is will show up in... Um, orange circle instead of white circle so basically that's what I'm doing I'm just looking around to try and find out um, if I can get some orange circles okay so I do not see the golems just yet on the map we're just gonna keep running around until we find them bitches I'm also going to equip my speed scroll so that I can teleport all over the place and not have to walk around as much As you can see other players are also fighting around the place. There's loads of enemies to kill, different types of enemies, everyone has their own uh, strengths and weaknesses. Their bosses, mini bosses are all over the fucking map. Uh, if not mini bosses you can also find uh, main bosses standing all over the place. Just find them randomly. Uh, once you figure them out and I accidentally triggered a fucking trap. And you can just, uh, just gonna, yep my attack is fairly strong at this point you know why because i was like really i my character is really weak because it's like a starting character so it like so fucking pissed me off that i was so fucking weak that i put all my fucking points upgrade points i don't i can't see it right here uh right there my strength is at 76 the, the, the stats are not that much in this game I don't even know how they work, but strength basically means attack power, I believe. So I just put all my attack uh, power into fucking strength. I don't even know if that's a good thing for mage, but they never really explained it. So uh, I was like, fuck this. I'll just put all my points into strength. Hopefully that will increase my... Here's a mini boss. As you can see, Minotaur King. Oh, shit. I activated that way too quick. I need to back out of here before he fucking... Oh, he cannot drop me. He just does 60 damage, that's nothing, that's fucking nothing, dude. Are you here to steal my kill, bro? Seriously? You know, kill steal. Well, doesn't really, uh, stealing, kills don't really get stolen. You both get stuff. 
uh, and these guys will respawn eventually I still have not found a single fire golem that's one of my quests to do I guess I cleared out this entire area of fire golems it says one out of eight uh, I think I killed them before the quest even activated and now I can find them they're not respawning uh, oh shit ah god damn it I pulled some aggro these clay orcs or whatever they're called and you would think you would become OP if you went to the older areas now nah. they are upgraded and the leader is calling I guess when you have friends or something and they are stronger than you they call you over for help I guess so as you can see he called me over for that boss I'm guessing oh shit let's uh, let's equip this thing oh. oh I do not have he's blocking my skills holy shit he called a fucking a really low level person to help him out because holy shit that guy and there's pretty much no repercussion for oh mother of god I just got here bro what the hell who did why did he think that I am strong enough to take this guy I'm 16 level dude holy shit he called me over for way too high of a fucking um, enemy look at that fucking hell he does 500 damage I have little over 1000 health even before I fucking reset my stats uh, it was like that attack is ridiculous I'll just stand back here and spam uh, normal fucking mage attacks just back out when he approaches me holy shit like and he goes back to his aggro again so he can cheese it but they're really fast when they're going back so it's preferable not to even bother with it and they're really fucking fast heal and as you can see this guy has some crazy AOE so there's not much to show for me because my character is way too low level for me to properly show off uh, the various movesets and various skill trees that are it's not super complex like you know how some games would be this is basically a fire or a circle basically kills the enemies who are in the vicinity anyway um, all I wanna say is that my character is not high enough to properly show off but the skill tree is not too extensive as you can clearly see it was just like four uh, four per, per, you know attack po attach points you can put in like vitality strength speed luck that's all you have uh, and you obviously you can put on stuff and upgrade them when you have two of them pretty much pretty damn simple nothing too exclusively interesting uh, the game is great but uh, for only those players who like to prefer games that grind I finished the first entire area region of the game because I was so fucking intrigued by it but uh, unfortunately I do not like playing games that have to grind levels so if you are someone who prefers this type of fantasy game who also likes to grind levels uh, by killing multiple enemies you know AOE skills like um, one of my uh, friends like to do that he really he plays another game that similar to this obviously not this pretty looking but you know it's an old school game that one it's pretty good so it's nothing like runescape with, with like extensive uh, you know whatever or different things you can do but uh, it's a pretty good game I would say so uh, as you can see it's pretty too it's well designed uh, thank you so much for watching the link in the description to the game also link to my twitter go follow me there's also a link to my patreon check that shit out uh, bye bye